it's Tessa and I'm here. I just got home from work and this Ipsy bag was in my mailbox. This is the November bag and I'm going to open it now. I heard that we're getting a... I have wonky hair today. I'm sorry. I was at work all day. <laughs> so that happens. Um, I heard that there was a M product in here which I'm excited to try and I'm excited to see that she actually put one in here. So the first thing we have here is the Ipsy card. This is Glam It Up. That's the name of the card this month. And you can win a year subscription to my Glam. And you have to take a photo of your my Glam. Take a photo of your Glam bag goodies and share it with Ipsy on Instagram or Facebook. And then there's a little list of all the products this month. And then we also got a 30% off coupon code for Michelle Fawn Cosmetics, which I actually may use that since she gave us a coupon. The bag is really cute, but it's kind of like crunchy. <laughs> it's like a little wristlet um, with a pink zipper. And let's see what's inside. I'm so excited. Oh, the first thing I have on top is M by Michelle Fawn, and this is the Lash Gallery Dramatic Volume Mascara in black, which is good because I did not want the brown one. I love mascara. I love trying new mascara, so this is awesome. This is worth it right here. Cute packaging. Just a white and silver tube. Dramatic Volume Mascara. Okie dokie. And it is a traditional, wait, yeah, traditional bristle brush. It looks like this. And it has like a scoop to it. Can you see that? How it's like bent up a little bit? It smells like mascara. And I'm excited to try this. So that is definitely a plus. This is a high-end makeup brand, so I'm assuming this is probably worth the amount of the $10 subscription right there. The next thing I got is Starlux Topaz. Must be an eyeliner. It looks like this. And I'll open it. How do we open it here? It'll be something I won't be able to open which happens to me every time I make a video. I can't open it. Holy cow, I'm digging right at the pencil. Um, why do I always get things I can't open on camera? Especially after work. My mind doesn't work that way. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It's like a silver gray color. That's pretty. I think that screams holiday. Doesn't it scream holiday to you? I like it. It's kind of hard. Like it's not a soft eyeliner, but that's okay. I definitely think it's workable and it is a really pretty color. So it has like a blue silver shimmer to it. I like it. The next thing in my bag is Be A Bombshell Hot Damn Lip Crayon. There it is there. And good bag this month. I'm already excited and I only have two things open. Hot oh, damn. I think I, <laughs> hot damn, I think I might have got this before in a different bag. The same color, but I'm not sure. But I don't think it was a lip crayon. I think it might have been a lipstick. That definitely has a crayon-y feel. Um, it's a pinky red. It's not a true, true red. It definitely has a pink sheen to it. There we go. So there's that, and I think it does twist up. Yeah, it twists up. So I'm not sure if I'll wear that color or not. I already have lip product on, or I'd put it on. Well, right over Tahoe, I already have on. It 
it's creamy. I like it. I actually would wear that. Not a bad color. Next, I have the Pixie Beauty Bronzer, Subtly Sun Touched. I don't know. Anyway, it looks like this. Pixie can be found at Target. And it is more expensive brand as well, so this month has been a good month. It's a twist open, and it looks like it has a sheen to it, but not glitter. So, it doesn't look like a bronzer to me. It's not quite dark enough to be a bronzer for me. And it's not even showing up at all on my hand. But actually, I put it there. I actually might be able to get away with that as a highlight because it has a little bit of sheen to it. I'll have to try that out and see. Two more things still. Wow. One, two, three, four, five, six products this month. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This is super exciting. This is the Baked Eyeshadow by BH Cosmetics, the Galaxy Chick. Um... And this is an asteroid. I was going to buy this palette. I looked at it several times. So I'm excited just to get a sample of what the palette is like. Because I may end up buying this one. This was on my list. So yay. I can't remember the last time I got an Ipsy bag. And I wanted and loved everything in my bag. Oh, this is pretty. Look how pretty that color is. It's like a blue and rusty cranberry color. And it looks like a full size. And it looks like a purpley taupe when I swatch it. I like it. I don't like that my camera doesn't want to focus, but it is pretty. Definitely a taupey purple. I like that a lot. I may have to buy that palette. <clears throat> and the last thing I got is a nail teeny nail lacquer. Here's the box. And let's see what this bad boy looks like. Yay, Ipsy! You really rocked it this month. Oh, this is pretty. This is called Caviar Cocktail Nail Lacquer, and it is a silver. It has some swirling in it. I have nail polish on, or I would um, swatch it, but I can't since I have a nail polish on. But I really like that color as well. That is everything I got in my Ipsy bag this month, and I actually like every single product I got. And I'm so surprised that there's actually six products in here, plus the 30% off coupon for um, M by Michelle Fawn. So good job with that, Michelle. I think that. You sending out a product this month in the bag with the coupon may up your sales this time. So, all right. Thanks for watching and have a good day. Bye-bye.